Yo, what's going on guys? We here checking out Pixie's Karma just released like 30 minutes ago. Really enjoyed Villain, which was their last comeback. So I'm looking forward to this. Let's go. 3, 2, 1. Let's go. Ooh. Turn it, turn it, turn it. <laughs> you can call me villain. <laughs> oh, that drop was crazy. Oh my god, this is so good. Ooh. Bro, this baseline is fucking god tier. Holy shit. Is a bitch. Oh, what the heck is this? Oh, <laughs> yo. Dun, 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 dun. That outro was insane. I've never seen like a countdown to to something like that before. Like 10, 9, 8, 7, 5, 5. Like, yo. <laughs> Bro, I love the whole groove of this song, man. The bass line was goaded. Their vocals were on point. I loved the little vocal effects sprinkled here and there. It didn't detract at all. It, If anything, it added to it. Like, I know how K-pop fans feel about vocal pitch, pitching the vocals and stuff. But I really like that, man. That was so good. I'm running this. Dude, this kind of really gives me like villain vibes as well. Uh, Truly like a... Uh, Jesus, that tongue, man. <laughs> Dude, I love these little DJ like scratches too at the beginning. The plucking, oh my, I love the plucking, man. Oh. I, li I like that. Oh. 
Oh, I just- she, I didn't even realize she actually flipped a coin and caught it. That's fire! Oh my god. I didn't even catch that the first time. Just two on with Coin. Dude, there's so many things that I missed on the first listen. This is a production masterpiece, man. And they switched it up right here. Oh, I fuck with this so hard, man. I really like this. <laughs> the vibe that gives is crazy. Bro, Pixie just makes good music, man. I don't know what to say. Like, this is definitely very faithful to what Villain was as a song as well. I actually listened to Villain quite a bit when it came out. Um, and this gives me more or less a little bit of the same vibe, a little different in some parts. But, Jesus, man, I just love their production in general. Like, they're not... I love the samples and vocal shops that they use in the production. Like, and it was just so groovy, man. Like, the vibes and everything... It was, and it was really dark too, like it had those dark undertones that I feel like is kind of Pixie's signature at this point. But man, I really enjoyed that, holy fuck. That was really, really, really good, you know?